this is Aiden's Toy Trove. Today we received our second shipment of Briarfest 2017 tickets. They're all three day passes. Briarfest is held in Lexington, Kentucky from July 14th to the 16th. Uh, it's Briar's big event. And um, you don't need a three day ticket to get into the park itself, but you need a three day ticket if you want to have the special run ticket and the celebration horse. So I'll show you what that's all about. Inside here, uh, there are a couple different things. One is the button. This button serves as your three-day pass to the Kentucky Horse Park. The yellow color is the adult button, so if you're an adult, you need a yellow button. I'm not sure what the exact age range is, but you can look it up on uh, Briar's website. And then there's a green button that is a, uh, a child version that will let a child get into the park for three days. And these are discounted versus what you would pay at the gate to get into the Kentucky Horse Park, so it's really not a bad uh, deal. This first ticket here is um, the Saturday show. It's the celebration of horses, and it's held in the uh, the Alltech Arena. It's air-conditioned, which is actually very awesome because Kentucky is very hot. Uh, Briar holds two shows on Friday and Saturday, but they are the exact same show. We just happened to opt for Saturday because um, we'll be showing on Friday and I have a feeling that uh, Friday evening will be quite busy for us. And this ticket here uh, is for the celebration horse Nazruddin or Nazruddin. I don't know how to pronounce his name but he is a gorgeous Marwari and he's on the Briar Marwari mold which was sculpted by Bridget Everill and he is free with every uh, three-day ticket package that you um, purchase. You uh, take this ticket up to by the uh, the old indoor arena kind of on the side by the ramp and you hand this ticket in and they'll give you uh, the briar bottle and this right here is um, what we were after this is the special run ticket um, with every three-day ticket you get a special run ticket and the special run ticket gives you a day this one is Saturday and it gives you a time 10 to 11 and it gives you a number and what happens is you show up at the briar store at the your assigned time and they draw a random number and the first number that they draw or the number that they draw is the first person through and then the, the uh, line runs through um, starting at that number and I believe it counts up I could be wrong though so don't take my word on that um, but this one is a Saturday ticket um, for 10 to 11, and because it's green, I believe all Saturdays are green, but we'll take a peek in the other packets. A lot of you have asked us if we are offering um, Briarfest um, special run pickups. Originally, our answer was no. Last year, Briar told us that pickups were not allowed, so we did not offer them this year. And then um, we were in contact with Briar and Briar said, pickups are allowed, but your buyer must purchase their own Briar Fest ticket. So that's the stipulation. Um, we will do a pickup, but you do need to purchase your own three day uh, ticket package. So this ticket package is also an adult ticket. Um, it has the celebration of horses, Saturday evening ticket, and it has the celebration horse, Nasrudin, and it also has another Saturday ticket and this one is from 2 to 3 p.m. and it's also number 342 and this here is a three-day parking pass uh, you can get also get these on uh, Briar's website and it is cheaper than paying parking at the gate so I recommend um, purchasing one of these uh, from Briar if you will be attending Briar Fest all three days. I believe they're about $15. So they're um, they're a pretty good deal. So that is our second ticket. And then this is our, our last ticket. I'm trying to just keep the paperwork and the envelopes over here that will be recycled that we don't really need. Um, and this one is, as you can see, this is the adult button, the yellow button, um, and again, this is um, the only ticket the Briar will let us purchase are these adult tickets. 
and um, yeah. So again, we have another Nazreddin Celebration Horse Redemption ticket, and these all come stapled. So um, we need to invest in the staple remover because I've broken a lot of uh, nails over these tickets. And then this is the Saturday evening celebration of horses. And then looks like we have a Friday ticket. It's also number 342. Uh, one of the things that kind of annoys me with when you, when you purchase tickets is that you get all sequential numbers. And I know that it's totally um, complete luck what number they draw on the line and they could draw your number every single time or they could draw it uh, not other times, but I really wish that Briar would stagger uh, the numbers that you get with your tickets. But that's a minor complaint. Uh, so, uh, back to Briar Fest pickups. Um, since Briar uh, asked us to have our buyers purchase their own tickets, it is permissible for the buyer to purchase a children's ticket, which is considerably cheaper than an adult's ticket. Um, I'm not going to post that anywhere officially on our website because um, I don't want to get in trouble with Briar, but I'm just going to tell you that you can purchase a children's ticket and we can pick up your horse with a children's ticket and it's just fine. It's just we can't purchase the children's ticket and um, that's why we are purchasing the adult tickets and we will be using those for entry as well. The Briar has a really uh, awesome lineup of horses um, for their special runs. Uh, we have all of those up on our website to see. Um, I'll put a link to um, the our Briarfest pickup information, which also has a link to all the horses' pictures, and you can check them out. Um, two of my favorites are Indu, who is uh, the Vallegro Mold in a dark steel dapple gray. Uh, he is a newer mold sculpted by Bridget Eberle. Really awesome. I love them. Uh, another one is Kaylee, who is the Yasmin mold, which was also sculpted by Bridget Eberle. She's a black Rabicano um, Arabian new mold that was made for the Premier Club. Absolutely gorgeous. And another one is Vahana, who was also sculpted for the Premier Club by Karen Gerhardt. And she's a really pretty, I think it's like a Gosh, uh, I want to say uh, a strawberry roan maybe. She might be a bay roan. I'm kind of drawing a blank, but she has the the braided mane with the bobs and the ribbon in her tail. So not the loose mane, but the um, the braided mane. And she's got really pretty roaning. I saw, let's see here. I saw Nazruddin at Briar West. I saw Vahana in person. I saw Kaylee in person. I saw Darjeeling. Darjeeling is the old uh, semi-rearing Mustang or Diablo mold and a really gorgeous um, glossy bay semi-leopard Appaloosa. I'm trying to think what uh, some of the other models are. There is Namast, Namaste. Um, that's the decorator. Uh, it's the Rejoice or the National Show Horse mold in a uh, decorator with henna tattoos. Uh, she's a glossy kind of metallic color um, and uh, she has decal stickers on her it looks like for her pattern. There's also, let's see here, Hindu, which is the cow, the dairy cow mold uh, in a glossy white and she comes with uh, her own kind of traditional celebratory blanket. Let me think, who am I missing? Maybe I'll think of some other tent special runs, but I'll, I'll move on to store special runs. They have Spanky and Dally, which is um, the Shetland Pony mold in Bay with the really cute Companion Terrier uh, in a brown and white. And then there is also Holly the Elephant. Very cool. It's the elephant mold with um, decorative um, decals. Very colorful. Very neat. Those will both be store special runs, or actually Holly will be a pop-up tent special run, Dally and Spanky will be the pop-up tent special run, and then there's Repeat the Beat, which is the bluegrass bandit mold and a blue or a black roan uh, Sabino. Uh, that should be a very popular model. And there is, who am I forgetting? 
Um, that's all I can think of for now. Um, but again, we have all these up on our website. Uh, you can t just take a look at them. I mean, even if you're not interested in purchasing, just take a look at them. Briar has a really killer lineup this year, and they have a set of four really beautiful single day stable mates this year. Um, maybe I'll make another video on that. I do have a blog post about them too, so you could look that up and check them out. We are offering pickups on those as well. But uh, I just kind of wanted to share with you guys uh, our tickets that we got today. And I will be moving on to other things. Uh, so thank you very much for watching, and I hope to meet some of you guys at Briarfest.